Hey friends, welcome back to my channel, Go Taste and See. And today I got a simple recipe for you, and it is the country style boneless beef rib. Now we're not going to be using a whole bunch of seasonings because, folks, sometimes seasonings can be a little expensive, but if you have a pop chef in your area, I would suggest you check out Pop Chef. Folks, now this brand here is called Nancy Lee, and this is the steak seasoning. And these are a dollar. So I'll be definitely going back to Pop Chef and getting more seasoning. I'm not using that, but I just want to show you this. So if you're buying your seasonings from somewhere else and they're expensive, you might want to check out a Pop Chef if they have it in your area. And I also got some uh, ground ginger from there too. Now, we're gonna get on into this video. And so folks, for this, I'm just using kosher salt, some black pepper, and then after these cook a little bit, and I don't want them to burn, I'm going to be going over this. And this is the Kraft Sweet Onion Barbecue Salt. Now, I hear that the tip to getting your ribs to fall off the bone, but not a, you know, they're not, they don't have any bones in them, but the tip is to um, cook them slow at about 275 for three hours. I'm starting dinner a little late. Uh, it's 545, folks, and I am definitely not going to probably be cooking ribs for three hours. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cook mine at 350. So I'm just going to go in with a little kosher salt. And I don't use a lot of sodium, folks. I always check my sodium contents. Now this is 400 milligrams. And then we're going to go in with some black pepper. This is just some great value pepper. We're going to go in with a little bit of that. And we're going to flip those over. And we're going to do that on the other side. A little kosher salt on that and a little black pepper. Now, now these are the beef rib, beef, beef ribs. Um, I don't eat pork, so we're going to go ahead and cover these and put these in the oven 350. So I'm hoping we usually eat maybe about 7 or 7.30 or so. I'm hoping they'll be done by then. So we're going to say about an hour and a half. So folks, now we're going to pause and I'm going to cover these and go ahead and put these in the oven. And we'll see how they turn out. And our ribs turn out beautifully. So I am really going to enjoy these with a side of cheese potatoes folks thanks for watching my video and i'd love for you to try this and if you're not subscribed consider subscribing to my channel we're trying to cook healthy and low sodium foods here on oh taste and see thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video